First, my name is Egg. It's my documented name is Erkin Gune. I'm Turkish Cypriot. I've grown up in London and um, at this present moment I'm the chairman of the first Turkish mosque in the United Kingdom. In London we've become a part of uh, a consumer monster. We've been programmed to believe that we need to earn lots of money, have nice cars, big houses, but really that's not the truth. This is all what we call in our Turkish uh, a lie, a lie world. I've been doing a little bit of uh, personal healing work with um, a known friend of mine who I've had the pleasure of crossing her path, Janita, who is also um, a shaman. I spent a lot of time in the jungle with the uh, indigenous tribes. So she helped me out quite a lot. Quite recently, well, let's say last week, there was talks maybe two weeks ago, John saying that we're going to the jungle, we're going to Brazil, we're going to meet the the 11 chiefs tribes of the indigenous and you got to come. So five times in the last week, Egg, you're coming. John, I'm not coming. Egg, you're, you're coming. I said, John, definitely I'm not coming. So it was on and off for about four or five times. Last minute, the day before, some events took place and I rang him up. It was 7.45 in the morning. I said, John, I'm coming. He said, I know you're coming. I'm not leaving without you. And I find myself in this very spiritual, heavenly place with the most loving, beautiful people, uh, the indigenous Yawanawa, the chiefs and his sons. We've been, the last few days, practicing the medicines, uh, ayahuasca. They call it uni, I believe, we call it uni. And um, I've been working with this medicine for a few years and it has had profound healing effects. And I personally have been through some really traumatic times, um, extreme traumatic times. And uh, the medicine has helped me recalibrate my mind detoxify my body. I purged a hell of a lot of uh, poisons um, that I, we are all consuming in the cities. I'm here with John Beach. I'm indebted to him to actually plant the seed and, and, and say, I'm not leaving without you to bring me here. Um, and I'm really grateful for that. So, as I was saying, uh, and here he is, John, uh, John Beach. This is the man that is uh, responsible for getting me. I was just telling them, I was just telling them um, the challenge that I had uh, coming here. I wasn't coming, I was coming. Yes. No, you're coming. I'm not leaving without you. And um, it was so profound that it wasn't going to happen. And for some reason he knew I was coming but I knew that I didn't think I was coming so we just got to that point where um, this is John Beach <laughs> this is the man responsible <laughs> I have a disability so for me to get to the indigenous tribes would have been very difficult um, so for this to be accessible made it possible and I didn't expect to find what I found here um, it's been made so easy and so manageable for me. Um, someone that has limitations of walking and moving and stuff like that. So I only you have you a... You were on two sticks. I was. Ago. Before I Before actually started taking the medicine, I was walking with two sticks. Um, and I actually purged quite a lot of chemicals and poisons that was in my body that I didn't even know were in my body. 
And so I've been diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder, clinically depressed, and I feel a lot more at peace um, where the medicine has done a lot of healing work. To come here and spend a week emerging with the indigenous culture and for us, we can come in one week, seven days, and get this. A one week immersion, which would take you, in my experience, at least a month and a half to go into the Bumble, forest yeah. and come back out of the forest and yeah. process it all. So this, for this reason, you have to come. The only issue I have is that I have to go back. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't go back. I, you are leaving without me. Yeah. I'm staying. But he's staying. In essence, come, be humbled by the beauty of their traditions and the simplicity of their intentions and you're gonna get you're gonna get a beautiful healing that's gonna carry forward into when you get home and on and on and beyond and then you're gonna be able to spread that and be in a position where your vibration is raised and what you put out you get back so come